For those of you who have been around here for a while, you'll already know this. But for those of you who are new here, hello, my name is Danielle. I'm so glad you decided to stop by my channel and check out this video. I hope you'll like it, want to subscribe, and check out what else I do here. But um, the thing that people will know, besides my name, <laughs> um, if they've been around for a while, is that my um, one of my biggest insecurities is my hair because it's thin. And right now I literally have all of it pulled around to the front. This is all the hair I've got to work with. I do the best with what I've got and that's all I can do, but sometimes I'd like a little help. So when Doris Hair Company reached out to me, I was like, yeah, I will totally take you up on this. <laughs> they asked if I would be interested in trying out some of their hair extensions and just sharing it with you guys and letting them know what I think and letting you know what I think. And so I was totally down with that. So it, they were so nice. They let me choose what I wanted. And when I sent the email back saying which ones I wanted, um, the girl was like, well, we think those might be too short on you. Would you maybe want the next length? And I said, thank you, but I actually already have this type of extension in that next length. And so that's kind of why, kind of why I wanted to stick with this length. And she's like, okay, great, no problem, and sent it. So um, also I think that was nice because, you know, they've seen me in videos and seen my hair. So I think she was probably looking and trying to gauge what might work best for me. And that length would add length. Where this, I was kind of going for just more fullness, being at the length that my hair kind of more already is. So, it came like this in a mailer. So, we're going to open it up together and check this all out from beginning to end because that's what I like to do. I like to uh, be surprised or terrified along with you guys. <laughs> so, I think that's it. Yep. Oh, no. There's a little packing slip in there. And this is what it looks like. You will see it is 100% human hair. You guys, if you're going to invest in extensions, make sure you're getting 100% human hair. You know why? Because it's human hair. So you can do everything to it that you can do to your own hair. You can straighten it, you can curl it, you can use a waver on it, you can color it, you can cut it, you can wash it, whatever. But you can do any of those things with this hair because it's real hair. So first of all, I love the color of this box. And look at how it's like glittery gold right there. So we're going to go ahead and open this up. It is sealed. You'll see when you get it. Bottom's like this. But the top is sealed. Once you break that seal, it's yours, girl. So <laughs> I decided not to have you watch me struggle to open that. So I went ahead and did it. This is um, 14 inch. It is the, um, they call it wire hair extensions, which is also halo extensions. Same thing. And this is 70 grams of hair um, on the one left. And then it also gives you two extra pieces, which is an extra 30 grams that you can clip in for a little extra fullness, like if you need up at the front or on the sides. Um, I'm seeing, ooh, nice. This is a really nice comb. I'm gonna get it out of this package so we can look at it. This is super nice. I'm really excited about this because I needed to get a new one. And this one, I got like a little plasticky one and something I recently got, but this is the real deal. So it has their brand name on it right there, which is a nice touch. And then it's got the metal here. Perfect for separating and for pulling through, which you will see um, when I'm putting the extensions in. And then look at the extensions themselves, but I see more stuff in here. So we've got the little booklet that kind of tells you about all the different kinds of extensions they have, tells you how to put them in, um, you know, how to take care of them, all that good stuff. So I always appreciate that. And then they gave me some lashes. Look at those. Ooh, those look fun. Okay, I'm all about that. <laughs> what a fun extra. And then these are the um, extensions themselves. So we've got the main piece in this one and then the two little extras in this. And look at that packaging. This is so nice. And I love, it says, um, oh, flip in here. I love that. Um, and it shows that it's 14 inch right on here and the color 4A so that I can see right on exactly what it is. Because I keep my extensions in like a little container thing all in their bags. So the ones that didn't have on, I wrote what kind of extensions they were on them so I can see when I go to grab ones out what, exactly what I'm using. So super perfect. And let's get these right out of here. So the main one comes with, you've got the wires in here and I would guess they might be different lengths. And also you have um, extra clips in case your clips come off or you wanted to add extra ones. So those are there, and then let me pull these wires. Oh yeah, they give you quite a few. 
I've never had where they give you so many. Okay, let me get these um, kind of untangled and I'll show you. Okay, so this is pretty cool. I've never had um, Halo hair extensions that came like this. So we've got, this is like more of like the fishing line, fishing wire, like it's more stiff. And we've got these two here, and I think this one might be a shorter length. Let's try. And yep, the one is a little bit shorter than the others. It's kind of hard for me to show you. So I've got that clip between my thumb and finger there, and then these other two are longer. So those are all that like more stiff fishing wire. Then they also give you three that are more of like that, um, like a little bit stretchy elastic, not like super stretchy, but more stretchy um, kind of material wire. And I'm sure these are the same way where one is a different length than the others. Let me, everything wants to tangle on me. Yeah, so one is longer actually than the other ones. So they give you all those wires. I think that is super awesome. And then the hair itself comes in a little net like this, which I always put it back in it. When I put it back in the bag, it just keeps it nice and neat. And then the hair itself, ooh, it looks so pretty. And I think it's gonna be a perfect match. Oh, and there's already a wire on it. Oh my gosh, so you get seven wires with this Halo extension. That's amazing. Oh my gosh. So even if then if you have other Halo extensions, you can use those wires on those too. Super cool. Okay. And then, so this is what the hair looks like. Very nice. Super soft. I mean, it's real hair. It's nicer than my actual hair. <laughs> I always think I'm like, thank you to whoever the awesome person was who gave this hair because it's so much nicer than mine. And how nice of them to cut all their hair off to be able to give it to somebody like me. Um, and so we've got the really soft lace here where it lays against your head there's nothing pokey or scratchy and we've got four clips there and then of course you've got like the um get my face out of there like the brush strip I kind of call it um little hook and you have different loops here that you can put it into to make it the um, length that you need it to be and then we've also got this these two pieces are also wrapped in um the netting and then they've got this little elastic holding them on. I'm gonna get this undone and then we'll look. Okay, and then these are two clip wefts and you get two of them. So that adds extra fullness. I will probably use them like right here because usually the um, halo extension sits a little lower and so that I can do that to add a little more um, volume. And so we are gonna go ahead and just put this on my head. So I'm actually gonna go ahead and take a little um, clip here and I'm gonna pull, oh, let me do this real fast. I'm gonna set this on my head to get the feel of where, with the clips closed <laughs> so that they don't get tangled in my hair, um, to get the feel of where the extension is gonna be at here. Okay, and then, it's kind of right there. All right. And then I'm going to go ahead and take the hair from like that area a little below it and kind of put it up in a little clip so that it's out of the way for a second here. People do this different ways. You just have to I mean, and you can look at different videos to see how different people do it. If this way doesn't work for you, you just have to find the way that seems to work best for you because that's the way you're going to want to do it. And um, so let's see. Because I know I prefer this way. It just makes it easier for me to get the uh, extension on and clipped in where I want it and not have to pull hair through it like crazy and stuff. So, um kind of how I like to do it. Okay, so I feel like that is going to be comfortable. So I'm going to take the back two clips first and unclip them and then clip them in to my hair. And then I will do the next two. If I make faces like something hurts, it's just like more of like a straining face. It's not because something actually hurts. I'm not gonna torture myself to put hair in. So 
I can assure you if it was something painful, I wouldn't be doing it. <laughs> okay, so it is nice and clipped in there. Let me show you. You can see around there. And then I'll take this here. I'm gonna let it down. Take a comb. We're gonna go all around where that wire is so we can pull the hair around and conceal it. Now, I will say if you have lighter hair, I do think it is easier to hide the, you know, wire um, just because your hair is lighter and so it blends in easier. But um, I can usually get it pretty good where it's like, I mean, you would really have to be like looking and being like, what is that thing in her hair? And if anyone's looking at it close to my head, well, good for them. Um, so let's do this. And actually, I don't know if I will need to put these extra two in that they give you. Hmm. On that one because it feels like it's doing pretty good. I'm just checking around the back feeling to make sure nothing's um, like looped up or anything with my hair where the clips were. Just kind of fluffing it out so it'll be a nice natural look and we won't see any of the extension there. Yeah, I don't know that I need these extra pieces right now. Should I put them in just for the fun of it? I mean, yeah, right? I mean, why not? So I'm gonna go ahead and do that. So I will go ahead and take hair right here. And actually, I just thought of something. This might be kind of cool and help make it feel more secure. So you can see that the um, wire is right here. Let me secure this back so I can have it on my way for a second. And um, I'm going to actually clip this weft around that because I think it'll help like even hold the, um, you know, wire in place so it won't be able to slide at all or anything. Oh, typically I like to give a little texture for the clips to grip on. So let me put these in on each side. And... Yeah, I'm just gonna go right around that wire. And I think that will do a good job of just giving me a little extra security there because then if for some weird reason the um, wire were to try to start sliding, it's not gonna be able to really go anywhere because this is holding it in place. So, go like this. Woo! Yeah, I am glad I'm adding it. So let me add the other side here. Okay, so I've got that side in now too. I'm gonna go ahead and just use a wet brush and very gently brush my hair here so we can kind of meld it all together. Obviously my hair was curled before, but it brushes out very easily out of my thin hair. My hair does hold curl pretty well, I will say. Um, I guess it's one perk of it being thin, but it also, like when I sleep on it, it completely flattens and stuff like that. So. Um, so there's that. But so here we go. Now I can see a little bit here the difference in color. You can see this compared to it's not bad though. Like it's like the lighting. So that's why I never wear um, my extensions straight. I curl them and when you curl it with your hair it all blends together. So that helps to hide if there is any like slight difference in color. It almost gives like a highlighted effect. So let me turn around and show you right now while it's like this, um, what things are looking like. Sorry, I don't have the most ideal situation for this, but you can see the length is like my hair length pretty much. So, um, which is what I wanted. So it's actually even, so this is the, this is my hair. And then this is the extension right here. So it's slightly shorter, but when I curl my hair, it shortens up a lot. That's my hair right there. I'm <laughs> Let me get a hold of the piece. Here we go. Okay. My hair and the extension. So maybe you can see that. So it's just 
slightly shorter than my hair. And so when I curl it, it's going to meld nicely. So I'm going to go ahead and curl it and then I'm going to come back and show you the finished everything all together and we'll see, does it look natural? What do we think of it? And we'll go from there. Okay, and so here we go. I've got everything nice and curled and this is all of it pulled forward. Let me push them back and I'm gonna show you the back of it. Now, something I do notice with um, extensions, the first like couple times you curl them, they maybe don't hold the curl like as well, but they kind of start to like do a better job of it, which makes sense. So I, it's, you know, it's heavier than what I'm used to for my hair for holding curl. And so um, usually if I know, like I put a light dusting of hairspray, I didn't right now, but if I was going to be going out with this in right now, um, I put just a light bit of hairspray, like a, um, uh, I'll show you what I use. I use this Aussie Mega because it's a flexible hold. So it's not like that sticky, crispy, like a heavy spray in your hair. It just it like lets your hair still be like soft and stuff, but holds the curl. So that's what I like to do, not something really heavy on the extensions because I like to be able to wear them several times before washing them and you know, not to have to wash them too often. And then they'll last longer. But so if you look close, you can tell there is a slight difference in color because like this curl right here is the extension. And like you can see kind of my hair here is a little bit darker, but that's okay. So I have a, like something that's hard for me is sometimes I get number two, which I believe is like dark brown. And then sometimes I do number four, which is a chocolate brown because I have like kind of those chocolatey um, shades in my hair. So sometimes the dark is too dark, like it almost looks black. And then sometimes the chocolate brown is a little bit lighter. And then sometimes either one is like the perfect match. So it just kind of depends. But like I said, this is perfect because it doesn't look like I have, it's not like two very distinct different colors of hair. So um, I'm very happy with the way the color of it looks. And I will go ahead and show you the before and after picture of what my hair looks like typically next to with the extensions in. Like look what a nice difference that is, just the extra fullness. These are so easy to put in. And then I'll show you up here on the top of my head where the wire is, right there. So it's pretty easy to like hide it in there. Well, and I've got some little silvery grays going on right now too. So that actually helps because it makes it look like it's just one of those little silvery grays hiding out in there. <laughs> um, but yeah, I am super happy with these so easy to put in. I think they look beautiful. I love that they add those two extra two clip wefts to just give the extra fullness here. And I mean, you could use it anywhere. If your hair is like really thin back here, you could put them back there to add more, you know, volume and stuff like that. So it's just a matter of where you want to use them, but you have that extra, you know, to be able to put wherever you want to. So I am so happy with these. I can't wait to hear what you guys think of how they look. And, um, I just feel so much more confident when I have extensions in. I actually wore some extensions to my friend's daughter's wedding recently, and I just feel so much more confident, so much prettier. And we were out on the dance floor all night. I was sweating like crazy. And I said to my friend, I go, can you tell I have my fake hair? In? And she's like, oh my gosh, no, but your hair looks gorgeous. And she knows me. She knows like my hair and that it's like uh, something I'm very self-conscious of, but it literally was something she wasn't ever looking at me throughout that whole day or night thinking, oh, she has extensions in. Like it just looked natural. That's what I want out of extensions. And I feel like that's definitely what these are doing. So they're just giving me, I'm so glad that I got the 14 inch because like I said, once my hair is curled, they're like the perfect length with it. And so it doesn't give me extra length. It just gives more volume. And that's really what I was looking for. And because I like the length of my hair, but yeah, I do like to add a little extra sometimes, but I am perfectly happy with this because I think it just looks very natural and blends beautifully with my hair and I am super excited about it. <laughs> so I also mentioned with halo extensions, um, I like to wear these if I'm going to wear a hat because I love to wear hats, but my hair is so thin that when I do, it like makes it very scraggly like under the hat. So halo extensions are great because I can pop those on. I don't even have to worry if it's like messily put in there and like the weft is showing because a hat is going over it. So you'll never see it anyway. And so it just adds that extra volume and it's such an easy way to do it. And I love that. And you can even, whether your hair is down with the hat on or you can put it in like a, you know, messy bun kind of low in the back or whatever you want to do. 
I just love having that option. You can also do with, you know, like headband type things because if you're worried about the um, wire showing, then you can cover it with a, you know, like one of the thick, you know, fabric headbands or whatever. And so there's so many options for ways to use it. And that's why I like to get some halo extensions like these ones because they're just quick to put in. I'm not having to do section by section and all that kind of stuff. And if I'm just wearing a hat or something like that, they are perfect for that. So, but obviously they look gorgeous without a hat on. So I can't wait to hear what you guys think. Thank you so much to Doris Hair for sending this out. And um, they are on Amazon. I will have linked down the description box all the information about this particular hair. They have so many different colors. And like I said, they have clip-ins, they have tape-ins, they have all sorts of different extensions. So different lengths, different colors, like I said. Um, so there is, you know, a, a wide variety to choose from for whatever your hair color might be. They also have ones that have like highlighting or like a biolage or, am I saying that right? You know what I'm talking about. Um, so there's all sorts of different options for color. And um, they also gave me a code for you guys to save some extra money. So that code is down in the description box also, but it is Danielle G5 and it gives you an extra 5% off of your order if you decide to purchase them. So you guys let me know what you think. And um, yeah, I, I can't tell you how good I feel when I have extensions in. I feel like a, just a totally different woman. It's like my alter ego comes out and I am like ready to go somewhere. Like I think my husband should probably take me on a date right now. <laughs> All right. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this. Oh, and I just want to mention again too real quick. I'm so happy about the extras, the comb, all the different wires. That's awesome. And then um, that they sent lashes too. Like, come on, can't beat that. So uh, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll talk to you again very soon. Bye.